Parents will see schools on strike again on Friday as rotating strikes return to School District 57. A full-scale strike could come as early as Tuesday morning. The BC Teachers Federation is armed with a strong mandate if it chooses to move to Stage 3 of job action. While parents are starting to make alternate plans for their children, the school district won't be making any preemptive plans. Preparations are underway for Friday's rotating strike, and a full-scale strike could be on the way as early as Tuesday. Tina Cousins, president of the Prince George School District Teachers Association, says teachers are sending a clear message. 86% is a large amount of teachers in this province that have said enough is enough and the government needs to come to the bargaining table with adequate resources for public education. The chaos that this situation has become with the lockout, not being able to finish up the school year as it should be, Let's hope that the government will come back to the table and deal with the BCTF and get this situation under control. The school district could get notice of a full-scale strike at any moment, but it doesn't want to jump the gun on preparing for a strike. Well, what we are doing is trying to um, predict and react to every possible situation or scenario that may come our way, and, um, and, and in doing so, uh, develop a strategy to address um, each issue or each situation that may arise. Parents are concerned about year-end proceedings. However, Brian Pepper says students should continue with their regular routines. At the current time, uh, the Minister of Education has been very clear that uh, provincial exams will continue. And our message has been that, and in addition to that, indicated to parents that uh, it's really important that students continue to come to school and work hard, complete their assignments. But I support the teachers and what they're doing. I think they should have classroom sizes and uh, a lot of stuff that they're fighting for. Lots of us support the teachers, but they can't be totally unrealistic in their, uh, in their expectations either. And uh, at the end of the day, it's the kids that get hurt the most. I just think they work really hard and that those guys are giving them, you know, the government's giving them the boot. And I think that, uh, yeah, they should fight back. Teachers will be back on this side of the fence again on Friday. School could be cancelled as early as Tuesday as the BCTF must give 72 hours notice before calling a full-scale strike. Victoria Levy, CKPG News.